Hey gang, you here? I'm just doing a little bit of maintenance today. I've got some cords to replace. Actually, I already replaced this one. And a, th a tip came to my mind, so I thought I'd share it with you. I got two of these DeWalt angle grinders off eBay for 40 bucks for the pair. And uh, they're in pretty good shape. They work pretty well, but they've obviously had some kind of repair done to them. And one of the things was on both of them, the cord was replaced. See how both of the prongs are the same width? Well, it seems to work, but obviously this is not cool. And they wrapped it around so aggressively, and they've got this kink in it. Now, I could get the kink out if I wanted to, but this bugs me, and I'm going to replace it. So I thought I'd share with you the tip. With uh, corded tools, especially the non-grounded kind, uh, whenever you get a chance, use a grounded plug as a replacement for a non-grounded plug in your corded tools that you use a lot. This really comes in handy because it's a lot stickier in your outlet. And for example, when you have an extension cord and you're tugging at your cord, it will stay connected to the cord a lot better when you've got this grounded plug. Or a grounded prong okay bonus tip for the metal worker beer on the welding table or any metal surface is a no-no never want to put a beer on a metal surface because the aluminum in the can is a high conductor of heat and uh, your beer will become room temperature in no time so an old cutoff wheel makes a great coaster, has very good insulating properties, and your beer will stay cold longer in the shop. Cozy helps too. So that's it. Have a nice day unless you have other plans. Peace.